This is the silver after five rinses. I will uh, start to process that soon. One more rinse, we're gonna call it quits, and then we'll start drying it. All right, so we're gonna dry this out. I'll use this clean rinse water for uh, the silver cell. And this right here will probably go into a uh, resting tank and then I will treat it. And uh, we'll uh, probably just put that in with my paper. I'm not gonna mess with that. And I wanna give you a quick shot of that um, water cell. You can see some copper hydroxides and uh, we'll pull that out tomorrow, next couple of days and, and look at it and just see. Let's see how much silver not really much silver, man. Uh, we'll uh, we'll take we'll clean this up right here, and uh, I'll flip it around for you guys. There's some silver on it. You can see that. Uh, that we'll uh, we'll process. Uh, we'll process it. I'm not gonna worry about that little bit, man. I'll put it in a beaker, and we'll clean it up. I'll take that plate, and we're gonna smelt it to capture it. It was a good experiment. Probably works on spoons and smaller stuff really well, but you can remove silver with just water. Not efficient like this silver stripping cell. Like we're we're almost done with this. This is this is a good amount of silver here. Uh, would I do it again? Absolutely. So stay tuned. We're gonna dry this out and get away. So let's tear it out, and that is 89 grams of cemented silver from this project.